The vibe and the energy here has just been fantastic, starting from 8 o'clock in the morning. Um, right now, lunch is happening, and everyone's chattering and networking, talking about all kinds of topics from the morning. Um, BC Web Woman will be 20 years old next year, and we've never brought a conference together. There was some activity on the list, and they were like, let's do a conference. Why don't we do a conference? So um, a group of us decided, hey, let's do this. And I had originally set the goal for 100 people. Well, as of yesterday, we are over 200 people. So I will give you a few rounds of applause. One little thing I learned today was a new tool that I can use with my photos to help me rank better in Google with the search engines. One of the things I learned today was how to build an iPhone app using Xcode. I really enjoyed the talk on responsive design for sure. It's very informative. You can do yoga in the office. It's important for women to keep track of their health because you know when you're coding 8 to 10 or sometimes even 8 to 16 hours a day, uh, you really need to remember that you have a body. This is a really great opportunity to learn uh, in an environment that's non-threatening, that's inclusive and uh, just has a great feeling of community. So, you know, just being in an environment where, you know, other women, you know, um, it kind of makes it more comfortable to ask questions, a little bit less intimidating. You know, it's, it's hard to be in this field as a professional, and, you know, especially sometimes as a woman. There's a lot of women here that maybe haven't been able to go to other events because they don't feel comfortable because the web and technology fields are so overwhelmed with men, and I, this is great. And I think we need to continue to do events like this and put a lot of effort into especially getting girls and younger women involved in this field and, and fields like this, like technology. So I think in, in the technology field, uh, especially in the web world, we tend to get really distracted by uh, the new and the shiny, uh, the, the technology that's coming out. Um, and we often forget about uh, what really matters, which is the people. Uh, the people who are behind it, the people who are making it, is the people who are who's going to push the work to, you know, awesome levels. And it doesn't matter whether you're a guy or gal, uh, you can make that happen. So I decided to come here because I really want more women in tech and women to feel empowered to enter tech and just tech to be more diverse in general. And so I've seen the folks who are um, coming into the industry for the first time and sort of learning the lingo and learning about different technologies, sort of where they'd like to be. Um, and I've also encountered people who are experienced and have been, do been doing this for a while and uh, they're looking for what's next. But at the same time, you know, this is all cool stuff, but I can't do it. I'm not smart enough to understand all these things that they're telling me. You know, these are, these are really impressive people up here on this stage. They've written books, they know a lot of things, and, you know, I just work a little nonprofit in D.C. I'm never going to be able to do these things that they're talking about. And I know a lot of people feel like that. Right, we all come from different backgrounds. We all come and are bringing different elements into what gets us excited, both in the examples and the actual tools that we're creating. But ultimately what we all did from the very beginning is we worked together, we all rolled up our sleeves and we sat down and we built stuff. I'm giving this as a point that, that you can do everything. You know, it's not like the people standing up here on stage, like me or anybody else, or even at the big conferences, the people that have written tons of books. It's not that they know more than you. You know, they, knew, they know different things than you maybe, but everybody here knows a lot of things. And all you have to do is kind of pick one thing and focus on it and learn about it and then start teaching others about it. I'm telling y'all, don't feel like you don't know anything. You know, and I know that it's easy to feel that way, but everybody, you know, can come up here and do this and speak at a conference. This is the whole award. In addition to celebrating our members, we want to celebrate individuals and companies in the D.C. metro area that represent the spirit of D.C. web women, which includes support and advocacy for women and girls in technology. Thank you all so much for coming and drinking here.